Liskov's substitution principle says, function that use pointer reference to the base class must be able to use the object of drive class without knowing it. To show what does that mean, I create a project name LSP within the source folder create package com.shape. Within package, create a class generic shape. Also create a class rectangle with a method draw rectangle. Put some sys out like drawing rectangle to make user aware of the execution of method. Similarly create a class square with method draw square inside it with some sys out to inform the user for the execution of method. Next, create a class context with method draw inside it, taking base class generic shape as an argument. User will interact with any of the base or the drive class by using context. As I already said, according to LSP, function that use pointer reference to the base class must be able to use the object of drive class without knowing it. But here, if we want to call the draw rectangle or the draw square method of the drive class, we have to typecast the generic class reference to the drive class. According to LSP, this method should have no knowledge of the drive class, but we are left with no other option than to use runtime type identification and typecast the base references to the drive class accordingly. But before that, we have to extend the generic class to both the rectangle and the square to make it a base class. Similarly, code for the square. Here we are using runtime type identification and this method knows that there exist at least two implementation of the base class generic shape. Even this approach violates the OCP principles as when we add any of the new shape we have to open the context class and modify the function and that's the reason you will find in many tutorials author says that LSP and OCP are closely related. And now, how we gonna overcome this? Let's see. Create an abstract method draw in a generic shape class and in all the drive class make the overridden method to implement the draw functionality. With this, in a generic class method, there's no need to use any runtime type identification or the casting. We can directly call the draw method of the shape class. Now, let's create a client with main method. Create an instance of the context class and call the draw method of it. With with any of the drive class of generic shape passed as dependency. Yeah, you can see it works. Change it to square. Oops, something missing. Yeah, change it south to draw square. Now it's working fine. 